Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new series. I'm going to be starting 7 days to die today. This is one I've been wanting to do for quite a while now. I used to play it in like 2016 was it when it came out on Xbox and I didn't get very far. I don't think I even got to the 7th day. <laughs> one memory I have of it is I was in an old house that I found and I was upstairs. It was at night and I was cooking some food and I was crouched down and I was waiting for it to become morning and I think I was eating in real life as well so I was just sitting on my bed waiting and it was all peaceful and quiet and then suddenly there was a fud on the door and a female zombie went Rawr! and I jumped out my skin and I just leant forward and turned off my Xbox so that's the memory I have of this game that it absolutely terrified me but I'm going to give it another go, especially now I've heard that it's had a recent update and it's been updated and changed quite a lot, so I'm quite excited to get into it. <laughs> Let's go. Are these my characters? Um, Let's create one. Let's call him Cloud. Oh my goodness, why have they given me this old man? Um, let's just go for curved hairstyles. Wow. Let's go for that one's okay. Can I zoom in? I want to look up closer. Um, breast size yeah I don't think I'm bothered about any of that stuff can I ah this is what I want change the hair so I don't look like an old man just dark dark brown it's too dark there that's okay yeah let's go with that Eyebrows, I'll make the same rough colour. I mean, it doesn't really matter, does it? Because I don't think we see ourselves in third person all that much when we play Seven Days to Die, so. Oh, I can zoom in. Yeah, that's okay. I'm happy with that. Although I do have pretty big hands. Let's turn that down a notch. Don't want shovels for hands. And done. Let's go with that. Why aren't it moving on? Let me go, let me play. Do I just press back? Ah, okay. Cloud. So that's pretty cool, I can make loads of different characters. In my game, let's just call it... Survival 1. I'm not sure what that means I don't know what is that I really don't know what all that means um let's just go for new random world world size um what do most people do should I go for the middle one friends only I doubt I'll be playing with anyone on this world, but I'll leave it as 8. I'll leave it as default. If I was playing by myself, I would probably put it on easy, but let's leave that as default. <laughs> the rest of that is okay. Um. Oh, that's scary. I put it, When I played this before, I put it on walk, but I'm not going to do that this time. I will keep it a sprint. As much as that scares me. Feral? What's a feral zombie? 
Let's put barrel is run because I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> I'll chicken out on that one just a little bit. Blood moon. Um, okay, I think that's okay. I'm not really sure if I should mess around with any more of this stuff. I think all of this should be alright. Mark airdrops. I think I'll enable that. Because I do remember that happening last time I played. Them being marked. And I want that. I'd like that. I'm not really going to bother with the multiplayer tab. You know what, that's, that's scaring me, I'm not going to lie, I want to put them as run. I don't want sprint, that sounds so scary. If, if I was playing by myself, I'd probably put them on walk, or maybe one up from walk, but I'm just going to go for run, because sprint is too much for me at the minute, I think. So there we go. Creating my world. Ooh, scary. That guy don't look very friendly, does he? Here we go! Dear friend, the wasteland can be an unforgiving place. I found you naked and left for dead with no supplies. It looks like you crossed the duke in a bad way and you could use some help. Enclosed is a short guide to help you survive. If you complete it, we might just take in a new citizen. The White River Settlement is real and it's safe. Peace be with you, friend, Noah. Basic survival is your active quest. The quest status is displayed on the objective tracker in the top right of the screen. For more information on quests, access your inventory and navigate to the quests menu. Oh, that's lovely. Got a friend already. That mouse sensitivity is a bit high. Let's see if I can turn that down. Controls. Interface sensitivity. Oh, it's probably look sensitivity in it. Let's put that on 20. See if that makes a difference. Oh, that's much better. Perfect. I don't know what any of these buttons do. What's all that stuff in my inventory there? Um, so I'm guessing that's food. That's water. Don't know what that is. Some flame. What's that? Looks like a post-it note in my inventory, but it's a book. Gather plant fibres. What's this? Empty water jar. Wrench schematic. Yeah, we'll have that. Why does he punch with his left arm? Is he left handed? How do I get my crafting menu? map. That's not naked. Bedroll. Craft. New journal entry. Okay, so now I've got to place my bedroll. Just out here. Shouldn't I find, like, a nice place to put it? It's a bit dangerous, isn't it? Just putting it here. Let's put it next to the burnt out car. That sure feels like home. Nice. Okay. Craft a stone axe. Gather plant fibres, wood, and small stones. That counts as wood. There's a small stone. I like how it tells me where everything is. So how do I open the inventory directly? Oh, that's not right what I've done there. That's not right. Let me look at the buttons. No point just pressing random things on my keyboard. Tool bell, uh, menus. Tab, okay. There. Craft my axe. Basic survival 2 of 8. 
next to uh, how do I move it? I clicked it but it's not coming along oh click and drag okay craft fiber clothes let's get me some clothes can you imagine if someone just started punching the ground outside and getting grass and making clothes he seems like the insane one here wear plant fiber clothing how do I get back to the naked man? There he is. Let's put my trousers on. And my jumper. Trousers are a bit short, aren't they? Craft wooden club. Ah, that's what I need. Let's chop down a tree. This is all chill at the minute, isn't it? Nice and relaxed. Having a lovely little time. I know it's not going to last. But yeah, very chill at the minute. Lovely and peaceful. Let's craft a club. Right, let's get that out of the way, so I don't know what that's for. Leave that in the hot pot. Let's move the water over there. And we'll put my club next to my axe. There. Now I'm coming along. Craft bow and arrows. Ah, that is what I want. That's what I'm needing. Gather feather. We gotta kill a bird. Look, there's a house over there. I wanna go have a look in a minute, I think. Oh, and an egg. Lovely. I can make myself a boiled egg. Primitive bow. And an arrow. Now I'm all ready to defend myself. Start a base. Another nest. Craft frame shapes. There. Place frame shape. Where should I put it? Um. It's odd that it wants me just to place it down anywhere. I guess I should put it over with my bed. Where's my bed gone? Oh, okay. Let's just put it here. Make it a little bit more homely. Oh, I've levitated it. I'm a magic man. Upgrade. Oh. Now that's going down. Ah, okay, let's right click. Basic survival, A out of 8. Build a campfire. Need more stones. Let's have a look see. I hope this isn't Chris's blood. There's another stone. Empty nest. No good to me. There's one. Anymore. There's another one over there. And there's my last stone. Oh my goodness, what's that? Was that a zombie? Oh look, a little rabbit. I kill that soon. So I've got something to eat. Oh, what am I doing? I was going to look for a crafting table then. There we go. I guess we'll put it over by my bedroll and my little block.
Let's put it here. And let's see if I can put it actually on the floor this time. There we go. Good job, Survivor. You have proved to be capable with much potential. We have marked your map with the nearest White River Outpost location. There you will find a trader where you can buy and sell goods and trade stories with our other friendly citizens. Welcome aboard, Noah. Wow. Noah's been a good friend to me so far. Journey to settlement. I don't think I'm going to go there just yet because I actually want to go and have a look at that house. Which might be a bad idea. But it's intrigued me. Brass trophy. Empty can. Okay. I'm not sure why I'd want both of these things, but I'll take them. Maybe I should actually bring my bedroll with me so I can set my spawn in the house. Or actually, maybe I can just make a new one once I get in there. I only need a few plant fibers. What's this? Looks like a, a generator. Odd. Oh, look, another little rabbit. This game feels so peaceful. It's not the death trap that I remember it. Is this the new update? It's actually become a lovely peaceful game now. This looks ominous. Another bird nest. And an egg. I might as well craft some more arrows in a minute. I must have enough for a good few. Journey's End. It's not a very hopeful name of a place that I'm walking towards. We've got music going. Not sure how I feel about that. Use door. Locked. Maybe there's a back door I can go through? Need to go careful. I don't like how quiet this is. This is a little unnerving. This is a lovely house. Look at this. These are like little pots and stuff. This is really nice. I might set up base here, you know. There's a back door. Chrysanthemum. Thumb. Looks like both of the doors are locked, so let's try bashing it down. Uh oh. Yeah, I think there's definitely zombies in here. Good best prepare for a battle. Oh my goodness, they sound horrible. Is that the feral? <gasps> Zombie! Ah, uh, look how he's walking. Uh. Right, come on, I, I can have you. Oh, I don't like this zombie. He don't look very nice at all. He looks strong. Let's try with the club. I should have made more arrows. Stay down. How many hits did it take? Whack. Is he dead? Oh, I can take my arrow back. That's going to be really useful. Let's make some more arrows. Uh oh. Sounds like they're breaking out back there. I hope there's not too many in here. Where did that zombie come from? He must have just been outside. Let's give you a hand. There he is. Let's get a bit of distance. I feel like I probably should leave this house, but I'm actually really interested to see inside. There might be might be a gun inside or anything. I've only got one tin of food, so it makes sense. Oh, 
Oh my goodness me. I thought they didn't run. Oh, I missed. Bullseye. That one was on point. Oh, nice. That sure took him out. Get my arrow. Let's have a look inside. Who's that? What a lovely house. Looks all cosy and warm. Shame about the zombies. Coffee. Paper. I have that. More paper. Electric timer relay schematic. What on earth is that? Look how lovely this place is. Wow. <gasps> he was hiding in the corner. Why is he running like that? So weird. Something like that. more. Ah! Uh, they're hiding. What happened there? Take that. Oh, it's another one of those weird ones. Ah. Uh, run. Take this. Can't get me. I'm doing quite well. They haven't managed to get a hit on me yet. Oh. Spoke too soon. Oh my goodness, why is she running? <gasps> and they can jump? Yikes. This house is full of zombies. Oh, I love a good headshot. Ew. Bashed your head off. That's what you get. <laughs> the way those ones run. Get him. And you... <laughs> What's that? What's it? It looked like she laid a giant egg. Bullets. Oh, nice. Now I just need a gun. Got all the luggage. They were trying to escape from the zombie horde. Trying to get somewhere safe. Flower. More paper. What happened there? Weird. Oh, I don't think this is a house. This is like some sort of lobby. Iron crossbow schematic. How do I make that? Reading the schematic will teach you how to craft this item. The quality of a crafting item is determined by its... Governing perk such as shotgun messiah for all shotguns. I'm not sure what that's done, but let's read the other schematic. That gets out my inventory. I think I've got another one. Do I not have another one? I'm sure I had three. What else is there? Cash register. Money. Is that what I can sell to the trader? Good job I stopped in here, innit? Because I'm penniless. What's that sound? Is that a zombie trying to play a piano?
Can I smash it? Oh, I can. What's God? Uh. What is that one? Oh, that doesn't sound good. Go, 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 go. That looks like a kitchen area. That's what I want. I want some food. Get out of my way. Oh, I don't like the face on that one. That's scary. That's a scary zombie. Any food for me? Toaster and everything there. Empty jar. Go be careful, there's no more. Why do they sound like they're running? They're not meant to be running. Boiled water. For a kitchen, there's a surprisingly lack of food. Cooking grill. Rotten flesh. Who put that in the kitchen? Gotta be something good in the fridge. More rotten flesh. Oh, a fully made coffee. I really don't like them sounds. There's more in us. Let's have a look upstairs. Oh. Or downstairs, rather. Is that a gym? What is this place meant to be? Is it something like some... There's one in there. That... Oh my goodness me. He broke out in one hit. Stay out of there. Now is really not a good time to be searching that. That one made me jump. Search the toilet? Sure that's a good idea. Oh, I can break them with one hit as well. I thought it was a really powerful zombie for a minute. Yeah, this is a gym. Some water. This must be like... I don't know. An apartment building? Cloth fragment. Got some hats. Should I put a hat on? I'm gonna put my hat on in a minute. Okay, now to go upstairs. Military armor parts? I'll definitely take them. Wow. This looks like a real nice house, doesn't it? Let's have a bash in here. See if I can find anything interesting. I'm really wanting food, to be honest. Food or a gun. Yeah, see, I quite like horror games. But I'm, I'm usually okay with horror campaigns, like Resident Evil. I really like Resident Evil. But what scares me about these type of horror games is I can mess myself up. With campaign games, you know at least the game's going to help you. And if you mess up, you got a checkpoint. But knowing me, I could lose all my stuff playing this game. What's this? Spikes. Oh. Come here. Take that. 75 health. I'm not sure how I get more health. Do I just eat and it goes up over time? What's happened to this room? 
Oh, sorry to disturb you. You can stay lying down. I don't mind. I'll be out of your hair in just a moment. Pop and pill sealed shipping crate. This item needs repairs. How do I repair it? What do I do? Repair. Okay. That's pretty simple. I was expecting it to be a bit more complicated, so that's good. Crack a book. Full oh, search ammo. That's all good stuff. Reinforced chest. So how do I open this stuff? Yeah, I'll take that. So how do I open those crates and that chest then? This goes outside. Nice little balcony, that's a good viewpoint. If I do set up base here. I think it's a bit big for a base, to be honest. Where's D2? Is he in the bathroom? Oh my goodness, there's two of them! Where did these spring from? This is not a good place to be! I can get through! Your leg is sprained! You are infected! Take antibiotics to avoid symptoms. You feel weak. Zombies, what you've done to me? How do I? I don't think I've got any antibiotics. Vitamins, painkillers. I haven't got any. So what's going to happen to me now? If I don't cure it, I don't, definitely don't have any. I don't know what these do. I could just take them. I suppose I could risk it. Don't know if that's done any good or not, but it's worth a try. Ah, uh, yeah, that makes my health go up. So is it not food? Maybe I should have an eat. Or actually, maybe I should save it. Shotgun. I don't know, I'm gonna have to have a look up about them because I don't wanna I don't wanna whack them if they're gonna get destroyed from it. Don't wanna risk it. I'll have to have a look because there's a shotgun in there, I don't wanna lose it. This item needs repairs. Oh dear. What do I need to repair that with? You do not have the required materials to repair this item. I don't know what I need. Oh dear. This isn't good. Well, it's surely it must be just either wood or stone. Or fibres. It must be something like that. So if I pop outside... What's that? If I pop outside and just get some more of those materials and try and repair them, surely it will fix it for me. So let's put some of this stuff in here. Considering I'm going to set up a temporary camp here. Let's just put some of that in there. Why is a trophy in a bag? <laughs> and a few more things in here. Oh, there's a schematic. I knew I had another one. 
See, I think them greyed out things encumber me by the look of it. So let's make a bedroll. And we'll put it down in the kitchen. As a temporary base. If I can. Ah, oh, that was perfect. Oh, I've messed it up. There. That's perfect. Do I only get one bedroll, or can I choose which bedroll I want to use? Because there's one outside as well. So what happens to that now? Is that, like, overwritten? Or, if I die, can I choose which one to go to? Let's chop down this... Oh, I can. Can I? I need the... That's what I need to repair. So let's just get some fibers. What's this? Take that. So I can find some stones. And wood. I need some of them little tiny trees, really, don't I? That I got from the start. I don't know how long it would take to break down a tree with my own hands. There's a zombie. Ah, there's some stones. What about now? Yes, I can repair it. Okay. Okay, that's good. So I just needed stones. Maybe I should stock up on some wood and stones and fibres. Because they don't seem to last very long, these tools. So I best make sure I've got some... Repair equipment on me at all times. So yeah, what I think I'll do for this day is... It's well too late to try and get to the traders now. So I'll stay in that house. This night, I'll secure the rest of the top floor out of stamina. Can I just eat it and get it back? Yeah, good, okay. Yeah, I'll secure the rest of the top floor and lock all the doors, and I'll stay over there for tonight. And then in the morning, I will go to the traders and take my money with me. And maybe I'll find some houses along the way, or anything else I can search, to find some more supplies, maybe more money. But yeah, I really do need more wood, um, not wood, uh, more food. So yeah, let me make a door, because I bash my way in through the back so I can reinforce that. And some more arrows. And we'll firm the house up a bit, make it a bit more safer. <laughs> Calm down. There's no need for that. What a racket. A bone? I wonder what I can do with that stuff. Like I've got a bone and rotten flesh and oh, their noises are so scary. Take that. I'm not afraid of you. I'm not sure what time it officially becomes night time. Is it midnight? Where they can start running about? Let me put my door in. Oops. There we go. And I think I can reinforce it. Lovely. And I put metal on it as well. I didn't know I had metal. 
Still hear noises in here. Okay. Oops. Was this door open all the time? I could have come in this way. Where is this? Oh, there's a zombie out here. Oh, this is right here. How did I miss that? There's a lot of zombies around here. Maybe this really wasn't the best choice to stop off at. I should have chose a smaller house. But yeah, let me stock up on some wood and some stones and some fibres and all that before it gets night time. And then when it is night time, I'll open up the rest of the rooms and search about. See if I can find some more food or even a handgun or a shotgun. I would be most grateful, especially as I've already got some bullets. Let me repair this. And this one. Getting the hang of it now. Looks like there's a little shed down there. Please give me some sort of food. I've eaten the only tin I had. Can I take the hay? <gasps> it's a dog! Oh no! Run! Run, 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 run! Come on! I hate dogs! <gasps> oh my gosh! Shoot him! Whack him! He's gonna get me! Kill him! You are bleeding! Use a bandage to stop the bleeding! I haven't got it no more! I used it! Oh no! Oh no! I'm dead! Oh, it's a good thing I set my spawn! Gosh, that's terrifying! What a bad dog! 